Hey guys, uh, this is Charles here. Uh, today we're going to be talking about, about uh, multiple hosts and drive failures on VSET. So this is one of those questions that crops up every now and then. And in fact, almost on every discussion of vSAN. So it's around the fact that, hey, can you fail one drive, two drives? Or can you fail a node, one node, two nodes, whatever it is? So the quick answer is we can actually fail up to a maximum of three nodes. And how we do this is through a policy. So we can set it up to FTP or fault to tolerate equals to three, so effectively three nodes. And if you look at it from a drive perspective, uh, assuming each node we can take up to 35 HDDs or SSDs, three nodes simply means we are talking about 105 drives in totality. And this is what just capacity drives we're talking about. We're not even talking about uh, caching drives. So today uh, I'm going to you know show you guys a little bit of a demo as to how I'm going to be filling uh, three nodes. So how I've configured it in such a way that I've got seven nodes configured um, because I don't actually have physically seven servers, so to speak. So I have seven nested ESXIs. And within them, each of them, I have three disk groups and seven hard drives in each disk group. So it comes to about a total of 24 drives, cache and capacity altogether. It's pretty much similar to what most customers would deploy uh, in a com common data center. Uh, most of the ready nodes out there usually have 24 drives or slots, so to speak. Uh, very rare you see a 35 drive. So I've not gone with 35, partly because I also kind of ran out of uh, capacity in my lab. So the policy that I built is FTP equals three using rate one and stripe width of 12. I've used 12 as a maximum because I wanted to get as much of the data on, on as many uh, drives as possible. So, yep, let's jump to my demo. So here's my um, vSphere client. So as you can see, I have a bunch of uh, VMs here that are nested VMs. Um, further down, there's a couple more down here. And these ones all form this virtual nested cluster of uh, vSAN. Right, so today, let's see, I'll minimize that for now. And I'll show you the policy that I've built. Give me one sec, I apologize, a little bit slow. Okay. Right, so that's the policy, like I mentioned earlier. So we have, we have uh, FTT3, um, stripe width of 12, and rate one. So just gonna show you here, send. Stripe 12, 3, rate 1. So basically, that's the policy we have put on. I've also created a VM. That's that. Okay, if you explore that, you will see it's FTT3, Stripe with 12, rate 1. You can see it there. Uh, alternatively, you can see it here. There. Right, so I've also brought up the console for that particular VM just to make sure it's actually running. So you spring out simple applications, you know, calculator, maybe just a folder here. Just make a couple of copies of that. Okay, so all working fine. All right, so let's fail some boxes. Uh, what I'm going to do here is just turn off a couple of these. This one. That's two. Okay. And so as, you, as they shut down, as you can see, the cluster is kind of going into disarray. Um, slowly, you, you see nodes failing. So let's give it a, a while. I'll come back to it. So I've given it a minute or two. Um, so you can see the, the three nodes that we failed are now showing us not responding. So technically with FTT equals three, uh, we, we are allowed to fail up to three. So hence I fail up to three. Like I mentioned before as well, oh, I actually forgot to show you. Um, each of these nodes actually do have 24 drives. So if I do go in the configure, this management,
So you can see there's three disk groups there, um, and each of them has got eight drives in it, right? So effectively, 24 drives on each node. So effectively, with, with, with three nodes failing, I have up to 20, 63 capacity drives that fail and um, nine nine cache drives. So let's go back to Windows and see what we have. Um, I'm just going to launch calculator again. Seems to be working fine. Okay. Oops. Um, bring up this. Make a couple of copies. Yep. Seems to be working okay as well. So as you can see, you know, well, 63 drive failure. Hope you guys found a bit um, useful this this little demo here. It's gonna consolidate all this. There you go.